ああ、OK。ああ、ここね。<笑>これとこれね。おいおい、すまちださんね。うん、ああ、OK、そう。Hello, everyone! おじさんのスピーチスペシャル、私はスナウ、アンケルイ、エウン、コンテンツクリエイター。みなさん、ときそい、リンクイソト、ルイエス、ユーチューブ、インスタグラム、エス、ティクトーク。おじをキャストは、ボイ、ディマンダー、ミデルドマンデ、ケボイ、アウェイティ、ペロン、ジャポネーゼ。And he is very Japanese. So, like, where are you from? I'm from Nagano. I've been there. I like it. It's a lot of nature there. A lot of snow. And a lot of snow monkeys. I don't like monkeys. They're so cute. I'll put a picture <laughs> here. <laughs> they're so cute. But none of the people don't like monkeys. So, are you ready for my. Well, it's, they're not my questions. Yeah. My followers' questions.、Mm, okay? I'm a little nervous, but. Most of my followers are Italian. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever been to Italy? No, never. I've been to Spain, though. I know. Why Spain and not Italy?、Uh, I, uh, I just visit my friends. So, sorry, cioè, ragazzi, c'ho tutto il foglio stropicciato. Ma non lo so. 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 Ma non lo Yeah, actually, that's,、uh, he's the only person I know from Italy. Most Italians, actually, Italians don't know who he is. Yeah, because he's famous in Japan. He's not famous at all in Italy. <laughs> the only person they know, the typical Italian, is this Girolamo Panzetta. So, Girolamo Panzetta. <laughs> okay, what about soccer players? I'm not a big fan of soccer, so. Politicians, you... artists. Painters. Don't. I look so bad in the video. Don't do it. <laughs> okay, his honest、Sorry. answer yeah, was Girolamo. Girolamo Pancetta. Number two is why don't you tip in Japan? Do you guys tip in Italy? In Italy, it's like it's not mandatory.、Mm. It's you like the service, you can leave a tip. You don't have coins, or maybe you, you don't feel like leaving it. No worries. I don't know, it's just a common sense that we don't tip, but we still g o t a great hospitality. Yeah, I love it. I love the fact that you don't have to. It's not only that you don't have to tip in Japan, but you shouldn't. Like, literally, if you tip, they will run after you when you leave the restaurant and be like, hey, you forgot this. In the US, if you don't leave a tip, it's like so bad. Yeah, so bad. You look so, like, you, you look so poor. So, Japan is famous for anime and manga, but、yep. do you know Western comics? Uh, Marvels? Okay. Spider Man, Superman. You read the comics? No, I just know. <laughs> Because we got so many, like, you know, great mangas and animes. Foreign movies are good. Cartoons are good. What's your favorite anime? I would say. Can I pick three? One Piece, definitely. Also, Kingdom. Hunter Hunter. Yeah. Those are my favorites. Attack on Titan. Already grotesque. Death Note. I'm sorry, but I have to. It's a classic, but it's so good. So yeah, good. Yeah, yeah. So, guns. Guns? I see your preference there. Right, okay. Oh my god, yes. Does it bother you when you see PDA on the street? You know how, like, in Japan, people don't kiss on the street? Uh, for me, no, but some old people might be uncomfortable to see them because I was, you know, living in the States. And, and, let me tell you,、yeah. in the States, it's not as, like, Common as in Italy.、Oh, yeah, that's true. Like in Italy, we make out in every corner. I feel like. Yeah. <laughs> so if you turn left, you see the couple making out, then turn right, then you see the couple. Pretty much, you know, when it's really intense, even in Italy, like they look at you and it's like, yo, go get a room, right? <laughs> But if it's like a kiss or just hugging, holding hands, it's like, oh, it's love, it's so sweet. Yeah, that's not、nice. so Italy. But it doesn't bother you. No, it doesn't bother me, but some people might be uncomfortable, definitely. Especially like elder generation. Even like just with holding hands? Holding hands? Yeah, maybe like our grandma, grandpa generation, they wouldn't like it.、Yeah. Holding hands in Italy is literally nothing. We don't even see it. It's like.、Yeah. I mean, like, it's, it's very normal for our generation, but like older people, it would be like a little bit uncomfortable. Especially in the countryside. If you're in Tokyo, definitely no problem. You know, hands. You hands can hold hands, but honestly, kissing? How often do you see. People kiss on the street. Ah, that's、I、rare. That's really rare. Only when they're drunk. I only see them at night when they're drunk. <laughs> 100%. Yeah. Okay, next. What's a stereotype about Japan that you don't like? Or maybe like a lot of foreign people believe that Japan is all anime world. <laughs> <laughs> What is anime world? 
like for example the train has like Naruto picture then like ship has like one piece like picture and if you go out like the street is all like covered with anime pictures that's image. Akihabara <laughs> yeah that's Akihabara it's like super specific like area right yeah and also like geisha samurai like it's like for tourists we don't yeah. see it normally. I don't think samurai still exist. They don't exist, but like you can see it in Kyoto, or you go to like specific yeah. temple or shrine. Kind can you of see like... samurai? Yeah, but it's fake one. Okay, fake yeah. one. Yeah, fake one. But, ones, yeah. but I think some geishas still exist. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. In Kyoto, but yeah. only in Kyoto, not like Tokyo. Or... It's like specific area, so it's not common. Any other stereotypes you don't like about Japan? Maybe like the Japanese are all shy or like eat sushi every day kind of thing. That it doesn't bother me. Just like misunderstanding, you know. Like people don't know well about Japan, but they can know. He's yeah. not shy. I can be like super nervous in camera. <laughs> He's not shy. Uh, Next one. What do the Japanese people think about Italy and Italian? Your personality definitely optimistic and a little lazy. <laughs> I'm not lazy at all. <laughs> I know it depends on person, but like generally. And also pizza? Pasta? We eat pizza every day. You do? I don't. Usually pizza is like something we eat once a week. The pizza is like our sushi, I guess. We eat sushi maybe once. Two weeks. Any other stereotypes you have? I don't know. I'm punctual. Yeah, that's true. I hate it. <laughs> Italians are often. Yeah, not but everybody. how bad often. is it? Like how how much I'm punctual? In general, like if it's it depends also on the occasion. Like if it's a party and I tell you like the party starts at six, it's usually not good to go at six. You oh. should go at like. 6, 20, 6, 30. But yeah. it also depends on northern Italy and southern Italy. Oh, interesting. In northern Italy, they're more like punctual. Oh. In southern Italy, less. Oh, yeah. There's a, uh, a island in Japan. It's called Okinawa. They are so unpunctual. Really? Yeah, they're like <laughs> Italian people. Like, they're always like, if you say, like, let's meet up at 6, then yeah. they started coming at 7. Is it true that you have a ritual where you clap your hands at the end of a what? Of a night out? Ah, uh, enkai ne? Like we call it nomikai? Yes. At the end of nomikai, you clap your hands. Yes, especially if we do it with uh, with our colleagues or our boss. I because guess I never noticed. We hang out with a lot of like company people. Yeah. Right. More than like friends. Like different culture from you guys, but yeah, we definitely do. At the end, we always like standing up. Then yo. I might have done it, but I just yeah. don't remember. I thought that they were like, it was a good party, yay! This is like, this is like a sign. Yo. I was probably like, oh yeah. <laughs> you were like, oh yeah. Yeah, good party, good party. Fun. We don't do it like with friends. More like company thing, I guess. How do you stay calm during earthquakes? I'm just super used to it, actually. When the earthquake comes, I was like, oh, it's shaking, it's shaking. Nice stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're used to it after one year, two years. The first time, maybe, you know, you can be like freak out a little, but experience will solve the problem. Uh, I also want to add something. Here in Japan, I don't freak out when there's an earthquake because I really trust the Japanese buildings because I know that they really pay attention uh, to yeah, like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But in Italy, I freak out. Whenever <laughs> there's an earthquake, even after having lived in Japan, if I'm at home and there's an earthquake, I'm like, <gasps> boom, boom, like my heart starts racing. I'm like, oh my God, what should I do? In Japan, I'm like chilling, Casual. maybe open first, the door. First experience. I don't remember it, but I got so used to it that now, like, I was in a meeting the other day and there was like a long earthquake. It wasn't strong, but it was long. And I was like, oh, there's an earthquake. And my Italian, like the Italian person was like, run, you have to go. And I was like, no, 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 it's all good. But it kept shaking for a while and he was like, you have to leave now. I was like, no, I'm just gonna open the window. It's fine. <laughs> That's like me, yeah. I don't need an open windows. I'm just... You should, you never know. I just like, if I'm working. <laughs> <laughs> Last, what's something you don't like about foreigners in general? That's, That's actually, I don't know, you're asking wrong person. I don't know. Because you love foreigners? Why am I asking the wrong person? I like you guys, but hmm. He really loves us. I love Japanese people too. He loves everybody. <laughs> Eh, Maybe you guys are drunk. You guys are too loud. We just said that the Japanese drink too much. But you guys are loud. Yeah, you guys are loud. I mean, like, I'm loud, so. He's loud! I, mean, <laughs> I can say that, but if I have to pick one, 
when you compare to Japanese people, Japanese people speak like, you know, whispering. Yeah. I'm not sure that even microphone got my voice now. If you go to Izakaya, you can hear to hear. If you go to Izakaya, it's like, Yeah, yeah, yeah. We shout. I wouldn't say shout, but we are loud. So if you are really like, can't make noise, you don't get food. <laughs> you just sit there and drink water. But I agree that usually when there's like, when you hear something on a train, you turn around and it's a foreigner. Because on the train, it's kind of manner, you know, you can't speak. Be quiet or don't speak. You, you speak. can't pick your phone. I speak, but when I'm with like foreigners, I speak. Yeah, yeah and I'm like... <laughs> but when I like, talk to Japanese, I wouldn't do it because like people are gonna judge me. Yeah, it's kind of like, you know, rude thing to do, but sorry. <laughs> He's so reckless. <laughs> okay, these were your questions. Can you think of other questions? Because if you do, then I'll shoot another video with him. Let me know. Mm. I'll answer everything. His <laughs> links are down below. Thank you again for being here, and I'll see you yeah, next thanks time. Thanks for having me. Ciao, ciao. Peace.